Good evening. Good evening, Margarita, Mayra Patricia, Karen, Jairo. <laughs> Hello, how are you? Hello, I'm fine. Thank you. And you? Yeah, I'm very good too. Thank you for asking. I feel a lot better. <laughs> okay. <laughs> good. It's good to see everyone. Thank you for connecting to the class on time because it's exactly 9 p.m. And today we are going to have a very important class because uh, you are going to learn about expressing desires in English. So this is our class number six and it's Thursday, June 1st, 2023. So Goodbye, May. Welcome, June. We are now in the middle of the year. Can you imagine? We are now closer to, to, closer to 2024. <laughs> okay, so let's see. We have an objective. Uh, Margarita, would you like to read the objective, please? Oh, thank you. Expressing wishes and desires is a big part of communicating with friends. Learn how to express wishes that you have about your personal life, career, or health. Thank you. Exactly. So uh, we are going to learn how to express desires and wishes. Wishes in English, right? And especially in our personal life, career, or health. Okay, we have the following activities, recalling previous knowledge, expressing wishes and desires, practice, and wrap up. Okay, great. But before we start, I'm going to take the attendance. Okay, so please say present or here when I mention your name. Excuse me, guys. Okay, Adriana Gretel Gonzalez. Um, Ana Silvia Rodriguez de Funes. Uh, Blanca Guadalupe Benavides. Present, teacher. Thank you. Blanca Margarita Guevara. Present. Brian Hyberson Escobar. Um, David Alonso Mejia Flores, Esaú Ismael Tobar, Evelyn Janet Marroquín Ramos. Present teacher. Okay, Evelyn, thank you for connecting to the class. Okay, igual. Francisco Villafuerte. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Francisco from the Urdes, Glendy Elisette Flores. Glendy, you're not in the class today. Giselle Marie Hernandez. <laughs> Brian, Brian Hyberson. Hi. <sighs> okay, Brian. Uh, Giselle Marie, not present. Iris Janet Martinez. Present teacher. Okay, Iris. Isaura Evelia Vasquez. Present teacher. Thank you. Jairo Naaman Mos Ortiz. Good evening, everybody. Good evening, Jairo. Josue Miguel Portillo Alfaro. Present. Thank you. Karen Elizabeth Bernal de Adelar. Present teacher. Okay, Karen. Karen Yvette Villanueva Guzmán. Karen Yvette. Kenia Vanessa Corbera Portillo. Leslie Victoria Morán. Uh, Le Luisa Ariana. Present. Mayra Patricia Perez de Garcia. I'm here, teacher. Thank you, Mayra. 
Nerlin Jaciel Flores Reyes. Ninrod Saúl Guzmán. Nubia Cristina Morales. Alexander. Nubia. Sí, present. Ok, Oscar Alexander Santana. Renato Salvador Ramírez. Present, teacher. Ok, Renato, thank you. Ruth Noemí Beltrán Sánchez. Present, teacher. Thank you, Ruth. Jenny Carolina Ardón Cruz. Present, teacher. Ok, Jenny. Ok, I had a message. David Alonso Mejía. Present. Ok, David Alonso Mejía. Ana Silvia Rodríguez. Present, teacher. Ok, anybody else? No? Ok, thank you so much for connecting on time. Thank you for your puntuality. I appreciate it. Well, as I told you, today we are going to learn about expressing desires. But before that, before we start with this topic, we are going to practice what we studied yet on Tuesday. We studied, do you remember? What was the topic on last Tuesday, last class? What was the topic? Hey, what happened to your memory? Make your hamsters run and work. Uh, com comparative and... Comparison. Exactly, evaluation, comparisons. Evaluation, evaluation. Com evaluations and comparisons with adjectives. And... And... Now... Verbs. Nouns. With adjectives and nouns. Okay, in this moment, you can see in each picture, you will see... Uh, different sentences and um, describing the picture and you were going to tell me what is the sentence for example using the words in using the words in parentheses the neighbors make let's make this example together the neighbors the neighbors make a lot of noise so we can say the neighbors Hello, the neighbors, the neighbors. Much. The neighbors, too much. Nice, you know, the neighbor, too, Remember, a lot of noise. Noisy, noisy is a verb. Sorry, noisy is an adjective or a noun. Noisy. Adjective. It's an adjective. With adjectives, do you remember what do we use? The verb to be or other verbs? With adjectives. Noisy. noisy is an adjective. So do we use the verb to be or other verbs? Verb to be. The verb to be. And so we say if I have the neighbors, the verb to be will be. Are. are. The neighbors are, and then I use to and the adjective. The neighbors are. Are too noisy. Exactly. That's it. Easy, right? The neighbors are. So just verb to be plus as plus. Okay. In this case, it's an evaluation, right? The neighbors are too noisy. We, I'm using to and I'm using noisy, which is an adjective. So. Subject, verb, to, and adjective. Subject, verb, to be, to plus adjective. Okay, subject plus verb B plus to plus the adjective. Oh, I know. Ah. Wait, wait, wait. We are going to see enough in a moment. <laughs> okay? Good. Are you ready for the next? 
the slide. Next slide. Yes. 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 Okay. In the next picture, there's no privacy in my new house. There's no not enough privacy. Okay. There is okay, think about the different options. There are uh, there's uh don't have enough. This house, okay, we can say this house don't have enough privacy. Okay, this new house where you seen don't a uh, another verb, right? Don't have enough privacy. Bye -bye. Mm -hmm. Or we can say it's not private enough. enough. It's not private enough. Okay, we go over the next one. Oops. Excuse me. It's this. The next one. There's no, okay, that was the one. The next one. My old neighbors were loud. My new neighbors aren't noisy. This is a comparison between the old neighbors with the new neighbors. And you will use not as. What can you tell me? Okay, my old neighbor, uh, I don't know. Are you not us? Where are you not? Where are you not? Uh -huh. My new neighbors are not as noisy as my old neighbors. My new neighbors. My, as my old neighbors. Old exactly. Neighbors. Very good. My new neighbors. Are not as noisy or loud as my old neighbors. That's good, right? It's yeah. good. <laughs> okay, next exercise. Oh, look at this picture. Oh my God. <laughs> Okay, this blouse is size S. I wear size L. This blouse is is too small. Exactly, this, this blouse is too small. Very good. I I wear I wear a blouse too small. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm wearing. This blouse that is too small, or this blouse is too small. Okay, Oscar Alexander, now you are in the class. Esaú Ismael. Hello. Say present, please. Okay. Somebody else? Uh, yeah. Me, teacher. What's your name? Karen Villanueva. Karen Villanueva. Okay. Thanks. Good. So, this blouse is too small. Next, our new kitchen is too small. Our old kitchen was bigger.
Uh-huh. Or new kitchen, not as smooth. The new kitchen is a, is a small, no as a old kitchen. Okay, the new kitchen is too small. The old kitchen was bigger. So we can say, My, oh, our new kitchen is too small than the old kitchen. We, we have to use as, not as, as. So our new kitchen is not, not as, not as our old kitchen. Our new kitchen is not as, luego la, the adjective, the adjective. Our new as small, kitchen is not as bigger. Is not as bigger or small? You tell me. <laughs> I don't know. Oh. Bigger. No, no, no bigger. Uh -huh, bigger. Bigger is, is comparative. It's big. big. Uh -huh. Okay. Our new kitchen is not as big as, as the uh, as uh, our kitchen. old kitchen. Or small. Old kitchen small. Exactly. I'm saying our new kitchen is not as big as our old kitchen. It's a smaller, right? Okay. Let's see the next one. There's no space in my office. <coughs> this is very exaggerated, right? There's no space in my office, and we have enough, and we have an adjective, spacious. There is not there is space. Not enough is space, spacious in it's, my office. It start with the subject. It start with the subject. Remember, subject, verb, complement. Subject, verb, complement. My office, ah, very good. my office is, is not enough, more space. Or, my office is not a spacious adjective. It's not a spacious enough. Enough is at the end. My office is not spacious, spacious enough. Okay, we are using the adjective and enough. My office is not spacious enough. We can use enough before, but it could be a different and not the adjective. It will be my office doesn't have enough space. But a space is a noun, not an adjective. Right? A spacious is an adjective. A space is a noun. My office is not a spacious enough. No es lo suficientemente espaciosa. espaciosa. Uh -huh. My office doesn't have a lot of space. Espacio. Mi oficina no tiene suficiente, suficiente espacio. espacio. Exactly. You see the difference? Yes. Yes, I can see. Okay. It's the same idea, but in, in a different way. Okay, next. Now do it alone. I'm not gonna help. You can type it in the chat if you want the different options or you can tell me. 
Not as yet. You can start with the new house is the new house is too dark. Too dark. Too dark. Okay, yeah. remember, remember you will use the word in parentheses, not as as. Um The new house, the house is too dark, not as the old, uh, the old, my old our new, house. Our new house is too dark, not as the old one. We are going to make one sentence with the verb to be, one adjective, because here there are two adjectives, dark and bright. You will use only one. You have to use not as, as. What is the subject? Our. Our house. Okay, our new house. Our new house. Where to be? Our new house is. Our new house is. Is. No as bright. As. No as bright. Excellent, Margarita. Our new house is not as as bright as. The old one. Our old one, our old house, exactly. Our new house is not as bright as our old one, or as our old house. La nuestra nueva casa no es tan clara como la anterior, como nuestra vieja casa. ¿Ok? Se está comparando. Comparing, but using as, as, not as, as. Our new house is not as bright as our old one. It's too dark. And there are no more exercises. <laughs> yeah, I think- I want a more practice. <laughs> you need more practice. Yeah, I will try to send you some exercises so you can practice more, okay? But I don't know if you finished already all the exercises uh, about this in the platform. Did you? Yes, I did. Okay. Yes, I did. Yes, I did. I finished everything platform. Oh, the five sections or the section for this week? Five sections. Wow, Isaura, that's good for you. Good. Yes. <laughs> Congratulations. Well, the topic for this evening's class is how to express wishes in English. We use wish to express that we regret something or we would like something to be different than the way it is. I wish, I wish, I wish. So we use wish and then we will use the past simple of the verb. That is the structure. We want a situation in the present or the future to be different to what it is now. For example, I wish I ate more vegetables, but I don't. So I don't eat many vegetables. I wish I'd ate more vegetables, but I don't like vegetables. 
I wish, it's a desire. It's my desire, it's my wish, okay? Or I wish I had more money to buy a new car, for example. Okay, we're going to focus only with wish and past simple. But we also have wish plus plus continuous. Plus continuous, we want to be doing a different activity in the present or the future. The continuous. Example, I wish it weren't raining now, but it is raining now. It is raining, present continuous, right? I wish it weren't raining, past continuous. So the present change to the past simple. The present continuous change to the past continuous. Look at the following examples. Uh, I wish, and then you have the subject plus the simple past. I wish today were Sunday, but today the present is not Sunday, it's Thursday. We can also use the expression, if only, if only, if only I were not here now, but I am, I am here. If only I were not here now. I wish today were Sunday. So if you notice, we change to the simple past. We say, I wish, or if only, subject, simple past. And the simple past, for example, if you use the verb to be, uh, the verb to be will be where, where for all the subjects, for I, for you, for he, for she, for it, will be where. Because it's just a wish or a desire, it's, a, it's not, Real is just a desire, a wish, an imaginary situation. Okay, we have more examples here. Wish plus past tense to refer to present wishes. I live with my parents. I wish I didn't live with my parents. So in the negative, we can use the past, the auxiliary for the past in negative, which is didn't. And here you can see the other verb, live. I wish I didn't live with my parents. I wish I had my own apartment. Life is difficult. I wish it were easier. I wish it weren't so difficult. So this it's it, but if you notice, we are not using was, we are using where, where, where. yeah, after where. which, after which, where is used with all the pronouns. I wear, you wear, he wear, she wear, it wear, we wear, they wear. In the case of the bird to be. Now, another one, with can't, what is the pass of can? Go. Oh. Could, it's could. So, example, I can't move out. I can move. I wish I could move out. I wish I could move out. So I use the pass of can, which is good. Now, this is for the future. My parents, won't stop worrying about it. My parents won't stop worrying about me. I wish my parents or they, I wish they would stop. So, uh, would stop worrying about me. So when you use will to the past, you will use would okay for will you will use would let's see more examples we're gonna do it together we have some facts about people's lives we have to rewrite the sentences using which 
Remember, more than one answer is possible. Diane can wear contact lenses. Contact lenses. She wishes she could wear contact lenses. So she wishes, because we need to use the subject plus wish, plus the subject and the past. The past of can is? Cold. Could. Oh. Could. 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 Okay. Beth's class is so boring. She wish. She wishes. She wishes. She wishes. This what yes. her class. That's not Oh, we're not. We're, we're funny. We're not. Okay, she wishes her class were more interesting, or were not boring. We're not boring. Let's say like that. We're more interesting. She wishes her class were more interesting or were not so boring. Yeah. Where is the pass off? Is. Is. And boring is the opposite of Interesting. Interesting. Mm -hmm. Or we can say she wishes her class were not so boring. Number three. My parents can't afford a new car. My parents. They wish her. My. They wish her. Remember that more than one answer is they, uh -huh. they wish a wish um cool then then could buy could. a new car okay or they can afford a new car they wish they could afford a new car or they can buy a new car okay Number four, Dan can't fit into his old jeans. He wish. He wish or he wishes? Wish. Wish. He wishes. 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 Is third person singular? Wishes. He wishes. He wishes. He can. Uh, the pass of oh, air. Oh, 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 good. Oh, he wishes oh, he could. The verb. Uh, fit, 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 fit in into his old fashion. Old jeans. Old jeans. Okay. He wishes he could fit into his old jeans. The teacher wishes she could fit <laughs> into her old dresses. Everybody wishes. <laughs> <coughs> okay, number five. I can't remember my pin number. I wish. I, I wish. I wish. I wish I could remember my pin number. Number. Okay. And Laura doesn't have any free time. She wishes she had. She wishes she had. Uh, what is the pass had. of had? Uh, had. Had. She wishes uh, she had. Free time. More free time. More free time. More free time. More free time. I wish I had more free time. You, Yeni. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I need more free time. Yes, I think we all need more free time. <laughs> okay, good. Now, before we go to this activity, we are going to have more practice, okay? 
you know what? I wish I hadn't touched chili pepper with my hands. I rolled my I, I rolled my eyes and now ah it hurts okay uh, but I love chili pepper I can eat without it okay next next exercises look at the pictures and write what each person wishes using the words given here you can see the boy. And we have the verb to be, tall and strong. I wish I were. I wish I were tall and strong. Or I wish I was tall and strong. Okay, here we have was. It's also possible, but it's better to use where. Okay, good. Number two, look, he is riding a bicycle, but what is his wish? He wishes. He wishes wish had a car. Let's write it in the first person. In the first person. Let's do it in the first person. I wish. I wish. I wish. I wish. I could. I wish. I had a car. Yeah, because we have to use the the verb that is here, the words given here. So I wish. I had I had a, car. Car. a new car. <laughs> he doesn't have a car. He has a bicycle, it's raining, and he's getting wet. So it says, I wish I had a car. Maybe he <laughs> wants a car in the house because when I want, he wants a new car. <laughs> okay, that's a possibility, Paco. <laughs> okay, the next, number three. Oh, look, she's picking fruits. That's her job. What is her wish? She wishes. In the first person, I wish. I wish. Stop it. I wish. Work in office. Work. Work in office. Ah, what is the pronunciation of work in the past? Work. 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 Are you sure? Work. 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 I wish I worked. I wish I worked work. in an office. In, in an office. I, I wish work. I worked in an office. I, I work. Okay, in look a... at the old man. I wish. Wish. I wish. I wish I, wish I, I lived. I, I, I lived. I lived. I lived. I lived. I lived with my son. Why my son? Yes. I wish I lived with my son, but I'm here alone, forever alone. Okay? Okay. Next. Number five. I wish I can I... swim in. I wish I wish I could I wish I could swim. So swimming. I could help the girl in the drowning, right? I wish I could swim. Number six. I wish I don't live. Don't. Remember the, the past. We we changed to the past. I wish. I wish I don't live. Don't live is in the present. I live. What is the past of don't live? live. I didn't. Ah. I didn't. I didn't. I wished. I didn't. I didn't live. I wish live in the city. Uh -huh. I wish I didn't live in the city. I wish I could live in the country. The countryside. <laughs> Look at this man in the office. I wish uh, I wish I was a helicopter. I was. Okay, I wish I was or I wish I were. I were where? Helicopter pilot. A helicopter pilot. I wish I were a helicopter pilot. 
Have you ever heard a song, I wish you were here? What? I wish you were here. That's a song. Oh, the song is the Pink Floyd. From what? This song is the Pink Floyd. I wish you were from, here. From Pink Floyd. Well, there are many songs. There are many songs with, I wish you were here. Right, wish you were here. Yeah, and listen from Pink Floyd. From Pink Floyd, good, good. I listen to this song from Every Levine. But you know, I'm younger than you, Francisco, so it's another generation. <laughs> okay. okay. <laughs> good, good, but I didn't know Pink Floyd had that song. Okay, number eight. Look at this girl, she cut her hair. <laughs> I wish I had, I, no, I, I didn't. Ah, I negative. I, I didn't I have short hair. Exactly, I wish I didn't have short hair. <laughs> okay, that's funny. I wish I didn't have short hair. Or after, after a haircut, we can say, I wish I hadn't cut my ear right. Yeah, that happens very often to girls. I'm paint blue. <laughs> okay, good. So you see, it's not that difficult, right? You just have to change to the past, okay? Okay. Are you ready for your practice, your speaking practice? Not yet. Not yet. <laughs> okay, we have more here, more, ex more exercises. Can you do it, please? Remember, subject plus wish or wishes plus subject plus past simple. Example, I wish I had a new car. I don't have a new mobile phone. I wish. I wish I didn't. <laughs> I had a mobile phone. I wish I were not sick. You wish? Yeah, me too. Okay. <laughs> Number two, you don't own a house. You wish you owned. You wish you you owned or you had, right? Owned. 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 I work too hard. I wish I wish I don't have work. don't work hard. Don't I did I wish I did. I... Didn't. I had a. I didn't have. Don't have. I see work. I see George. Ah, okay. You do options, right? I wish I didn't work. I didn't work too hard. Or somebody said. Somebody said, I wish <coughs> I had a. An easy job. Somebody said that. Easy job. Okay, he isn't at home much. He wished. He wished. He wished. Was. 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 His word. Or he were. Well, he wished. He, he wishes, wishes he wishes he was, was he wishes he was he were where where um, where at the how much where where at how much i don't travel much teacher i, I want to question and the number yes, 4 uh uh, um, um, uh, just say he wishes he was is is 
is erroneous. You can use was, it's also possible. You can use was or where. Ah, okay. Thank I you. prefer to use where. Okay. But you can use you work. You can use was too. It's it's possible. Where is more okay, common? The per for it's the more common. Is where. Uh -huh. okay. He wishes he were at home much. Uh -huh. Okay. Yes. Don't trouble. Number five. Yes. To be, I wish I could travel much or, or the past. Uh, I wish I could travel. No, much. Yeah, I, I wish I could travel. I don't travel much. I wish I could travel. I could travel much, right? Much. I don't travel much. I wish I could travel much. Or I wish I traveled. You can also use the pass of travel. Travel. I wish I traveled much. Mm -hmm. uh, she does a lot of house housework. She, she wish. wishes she, she had less housework. Okay, she yeah. wishes she had less housework. <laughs> or, or she wishes she, what is the past of that? The pass of das. Did. 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 In the negative? Didn't. 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 Okay, she wishes she didn't do a lot of housework. Right? She wishes she didn't do a lot of housework. Right? She does a lot of housework. She didn't do a lot of housework. You don't get enough sleep. You wish. <coughs> mm -hmm. Didn't get. get enough. What Good is sleep. the pass of get? Got. 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 You wish you got. Get enough sleep. You got enough sleep you wish you got another sleep and my laptop is slow i wish, I wish my, laptop my laptop is weren't my were, laptop weren't were fast no. we're but faster fast. faster yeah. oh we're not so slow Mm -hmm. Or I wish my laptop were not slow. Or I wish my laptop were faster. Okay. And now, guys, are you ready to practice? I guess you are. Good. So, I uh, here we have. What do you wish you could change? Well, I'm not in very good shape. I wish I were more fit. So right now, we are going to use the chat and we are going to practice. We are going to have, a, or we are going to share our wishes. The topic is, the first topic is health. What are your wishes regarding to health? For example, I wish I could exercise more. <coughs> I 
I wish I ate less pupusas, but I love pupusas. Or fewer pupusas, because pupusas is, is town now. So it's fewer. I wish, I wish, I wish I ate, Francisco. I wish I ate less sweet bread, <laughs> less, less pastries, Francisco. Yes, it's not good for your health. It's not good for your blood sugar. I wish I could travel longer. No, this is just about health, guys, just about health. I wish I studied more English before. <laughs> this is just about health. about your health. <laughs> Francisco loves pastries. Yeah, it's an addiction, Francisco. That's an addiction. <laughs> but it's okay, Margarita. I wish I studied more English before. I wish I ate healthful food much. Healthy food, healthy food. Oh, I wish I said more. I wish I learned French. <laughs> Okay, now guys, our wishes regarding money. Ha, we have a lot of wishes regarding money. I wish I had more time to study, everything. to study. I wish I were rich. I wish I had a million dollars. Oh, it's out. I wish I had a lot of money to help my parents. I wish I had money for traveling. I wish I traveled to Spain. I wish I ate less junk food. Well, that's good, Saul. <coughs> okay. Now regarding education. Or personal things. Esau wishes he had two billion dollars. I wish I did more exercise. Good, Renato. I wish I could speak English fluently. Great. I wish I took gastronomy course. Oh, nice, Margarita. I wish I had a big house. I wish I had more vacations to travel. I wish I learned English well to be able to help those who don't know it. <laughs> okay, Isabra. I wish I took fruits. I wish I learned my, more languages. I wish I had a big house. I wish I had more time um, <laughs> I wish I were a Hollywood star. <laughs> so I wish I could have more time. Could have been, no, could have more time. I wish I have time to read more. Read, read, not ready, read. Uh -huh. Very good, Mayra. I wish my students could finish the platform exercises on time. I wish my students could finish the platform exercises on time. Karen, I wish I lived near my job. Near my job, yes, and you could avoid traffic. 
Oh, Carolina, I wish I could see my sister. I could see my sister. I wish I learned something programs well. I wish I learned programming. Programming is all. I wish I could be bilingual. Francisco, you are bilingual already. You speak English. I wish I ate pizza. <laughs> no, yeah. Oh, I wish I had more time to sleep. I wish I could travel in vacation. Great. Mm -hmm. <coughs> I wish my students wrote an example. Oh, I wish I didn't have to work tomorrow, okay, Raul. Look, I wish I didn't work on on, on Sundays. I wish, I wish I didn't work next Sunday, but I will have to work next Sunday. I wish I earn more money. Yes, Miguel, I think we all wish we earned more money. <laughs> oh, I wish I could finish. I wish I continue to study next month. To study. Look. I wish this class were earlier. Yeah, I wish this class were earlier, like 4 p.m. I wish we could be friends. Oh, oh that's so sweet, Karen. <laughs> Great. I love this topic because okay now let's let's um <laughs> okay Renato I wish you could have more time Yes, guys, just try to do it. Oh, my, I wish I had a little cat. Mm. Very good. Can we write about other people's wishes? For example, my mother wishes I had a baby. I wish I knew where the apostrophe is. <laughs> where the apostrophe is, okay. I wish my teacher continue in the past, continue. Continue to teach English. I think I will continue, Ruth. <laughs> With this group, I don't know, but I will continue teaching. I wish she could be. Okay. What about other people? Write about other people's wishes. Oh, my friend wishes he had an own business. Okay. My brother. Wishes he had his own restaurant. He likes cooking. Oh, my sister wishes she were a nurse. Excellent.
Look at this. My husband wishes he had more time for me. <laughs> my sister wishes she became a chef. Great. My dad wishes he won the lottery. <laughs> I wish she could, couldn't dance. Okay. My daughter wishes she could travel to Sacramento City. Great. My son wishes I bought a new TV. <laughs> Okay, great. I love it. Thank you guys for all your participations. My friend wishes he or she watched a new movie. My daughter wishes she, she finally finished or she finished her career. Okay. She finished. Okay, it's 10 to. I'm sorry, I know you want to continue in the English class, but it's time to finish. Can you tell me what did you learn in this class? What did you learn today? Nothing? Okay. Ah, just kidding. I know you learned. What did you learn? To talk for wishes. To express wishes and desires yes did you like the topic yes i like it. yes i like it. yes <laughs> yeah i i it was great it too it was it was good because you can express your ideas a lot okay guys i remember we have class tomorrow it's friday i know but we have class tomorrow okay so See you tomorrow. Teacher, Have a great pass night. Mm -hmm. Teacher. Okay. See you tomorrow. Yes, tomorrow. I pass. I took the attendance. I took eh, the attendance. Back. Tuve problemas para entrar. Glendy. Okay, somebody else? Igual yo, teacher. Oscar Santana. Oscar. Alexander, sí, ya lo puse. Somebody sí, else? Me, teacher. Leslie. Raúl Guzmán. Leslie. Leslie. Victoria. Okay, Adriana, no, Giselle, Kenia Corbera, Emma, no, Nerlin Haciel, Nerlin Haciel, not in class. Okay, they were the absences. Good guys, good night, see you tomorrow. Good night, good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Thank you. Good night. Welcome.